this game is heavy. Uh, well, we should be fine. As long as there's no stutter or anything like that. Dude, I'm at 100% CPU usage, though, because this is using 60%. Uh, I'm not even at 60 FPS. Custom. Shadows medium. All right. How bad is this? We have to reset the game. Oh, it doesn't relaunch, it just exits? That sucks. I have to relaunch it myself. Oh, it's because it crashed. <laughs> what the heck? The game crashed. That's why. Oh my god, I drop the graphics from very high to high and very high to medium, and it gets 30% lighter. Absolutely insane. 30% CPU load reduced by dropping down shadows and reflections. Wow. All right, I'm happy with that. That means I could actually play the game. Now let's begin. We made it to the skies. It's hard to believe our small group might remake the flying cities of old, but every story is beginning. Oh, I'm a bird. Advisor Quill. Okay. I'm a black uh, raven. If we recruit new followers and truly grow this into a flying city, maybe we'll stand a chance against those sky pirates. It feels like they really rule the airways right now. Anyways, enough daydreaming about reuniting an empire. Our first priority is to build ourselves a hangar. That will let us gather resources from the ground below so that we could build housing amongst other buildings. Once we got our bearings, let's visit Haven Mill, that big city north of us. Surely they'll have news of recent happenings. All right, I'm gonna pause. All right, so it looks like this is my ship. Oh, that is a citizen. Everyone's floating. Okay. So this is our housing. All right, cool. So first things first. Build a hangar. Oh. How do you rotate? Oh. Oh, okay. How do I want to do this? Let's have a nice long tail. Oh, I have to make a path first. Wait, you can't just connect straight up. Entrance not connected to path slash paths. So it looks like I need to have paths, right? Let's go, let's go. This is like a 3D printer, dude. Alright, we got the hangar. 
it allows us to what are we doing any buildings connected via paths walkable platforms sturdy connections tilt as adding too much weight on one side will tilt your kingdom and annoy your population wow Music control is click left mouse to select objects, right mouse to rotate, Q and E, WASD, move camera, C recentered. Okay. Okay. Movements. Your kingdom can move. Simply right click anywhere in your line, you start moving. Being unmoored had its advantages. You could get closer to resources otherwise. So I just move to that. So I right click that, it floats up a balloon, and then we work towards the balloon. On the top bar, you can see the amount of people that have joined you. The left is the number of people, and on the right is the number of housed. Each person requires a spot in a house. Inhabitants will no specify assigned tasks. With no specifically assigned tasks, will build any available connection. If there's no connection, and they're not assigned work, they'll show idle. Building some housing for now. Okay. I don't have the resources. Oh, I'm supposed to do that. Wait, how do I harvest? How do I harvest? Haven mill. Okay. Construction must research Academy Iron Forge research. Used by workers to gather resources. Okay. Center camera, map quest. How do I gather? Disassemble, customize. That's just color scheme. Our coal depletes. We fall to the ground. Wait, 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 wait. How do I harvest resources? I'm so confused. Hanger. We use this to gather, but I don't know how to gather. Idle. Yo, man, I'm, I'm completely lost. Oh, wow. That's what they meant. Okay, so they said right click to move and you want to move towards the resource. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now they're sending the planes. Oh my god. Thank you, Alinden. I was so lost.
I was so lost. Ancient ruin. Dude, this is tough. Because this game is in 3D, I feel like I could miss out on so much. Alright, so this is a thicket. This is a lake. Yeah, the, the UI was a little lacking. All a tavern in this small settlement, huh? Seems that we may call the stir. Everyone in town is eyeballing us. Some is interested. I bet we can convince a few folks to join us. But we don't have housing. Oh, okay. Requires housing. Alright. So I have no tilt so far. Alright, we're just building some uh, housing blocks. Okay, we're gonna use up all the wood. Thank you for that, man. I would have been just like, yo, guys, we wrapped this up. <laughs> I was about to wrap it up. Guys, I don't know what I'm doing, man. I'm lost. I'm gonna just wrap this up and play a new game. Alright, we did it, boys. Uh, let's go here. Empty forest. Automatic removes them. Nice. Let's send some workers there as well. Let's get some water. Let's get some trees. I don't know... This is weird. It looks like it doesn't matter where the housing path is. I don't know if that's actually true. All right, we could speed this up, not bad. I guess they're on downtime right now. All right, recruit more people. Probably coin to encourage them. That's fine. And then we have gather more resources. Left click on a forest. Okay. That should have been a lot earlier. Not gonna lie. We have a lot of water here. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, this is food. I need wood. Okay, let's go here. I was grabbing food for no reason. I didn't even know that. I was like, how come my wood's not going up? I have 150 coin. I want to get more uh, resources for more housing. There we go. It looks like it doesn't matter how this angles. All right, so now we could go here. Uh, we got some new bird friends. Uh, let's just get the first guy. Oh, we could recruit all of them. Hey, guys. Thanks for joining, man. Alright, we got the house. Now we gotta get an academy to research. And 
this requires dude a lot of wood okay I wonder how this is gonna play out man I could see this becoming procedural generated but I'm curious to see how they're gonna make you like move like you need incentive to move in this game or in these types of games if you don't have incentive to move or uh something to drive you dude there's there's this game's gonna down fast because it's one of those games where it's like having cool things to do isn't enough you're gonna need a motivating factor right so i'm curious to see what they're gonna do for that i wonder if this is gonna be a story based game story driven or if it's gonna be uh a little bit more open-ended because i feel like having objectives is nice Gives you a reason to play the game. Another thing is... This is kinda slow. Oh, I don't have anything in the front. I want to say we're we're not tipping. I don't actually know. I right, got the research. Grab the iron forge. We want to get four out of four people. Nice. Wait, 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 wait. Dude, I keep moving accidentally. Speed. Uh, with each building you construct, drag is added to your kingdom, which slows down your movement speed. To get your speed back up, you must create propulsion. When you travel faster, the less time it takes to get to places, the fewer resources you'll use along the way. Okay. So they want me to add more lifts. This requires something known as iron, so I need to get the iron forge first. Okay. Oh, they're researching, okay. Warehouse as well. Coal deposit. We have coal. Ancient ruins. All right, let's send a worker to the ancient ruins. Oh, it's nighttime. Oh, shit. <laughs> panel bullet hover. Hovering your mouse over the top bar will show you information panels. Bullet list. They could hover and click. Shortcut. Highlight a bullet. We'll highlight the workplace. Nice. Ah, nice, nice. All right. Got some upgrades and got the forge. I probably do want the warehouse. Okay, so... Five up required. All right. This might unbalance us a little bit. 55 weight from buildings with ability to carry 60 coal. No tilt issues. Okay. So we're barely okay. We have the people working. Oh, oh. I keep I keep accidentally moving man every time warehouse research nice we can't do the other stuff yet upgraded warehouse no lift for propulsion yet alright we'll go back to the basics 
Let's go for available planes. I don't have iron for that. Oh, no cost. Less food. Why not? Wait, can we not do this? We should be researching. So right now it's night time. Oh, I keep moving a plane, dude. I need to stop that. Hello, what's going on, Pixie Boy? Welcome in. Okay, so fully chopped. We gotta go to the next spot. There is coal there, there is food there. We're gonna go here. Oh, the ruins explored. You could hunt on that location. Okay. I don't know what hunting does for me, though. Alright, let's go here instead. Let's get some coal. What's going on, Lord of Heaven? Are you a fan of colony management genre? Yeah, I play a lot of it. A lot of the games I play are colony management. We got the lift. Okay, we need that later. What's going on, Lord of Heaven? I see you over there. How are you? Hello, hello. Alright, we need to go to Haven, Will. Late the stream, how's it going? Just checking out some games, checking out some demos. We just got through Citadelum, and right now we're checking out Airborne Kingdom. Yo, man, it's hot, dude. Mom was just trying to say cool. You know how it is. Otherwise, though, it's Saturday. Hope you're, you know, relaxed, chilling. Having a good time. Alright, so we're done with that. Let's keep moving. First impression of the games. I like Citadelum. This game... Might be too chill. I want to see how they kind of flesh it out, though. It might just be a slow start. But effectively, this is kind of like, you know, a wandering village, but you get a control where you move to. Cotton, wood, I wouldn't mind some wood. Was that a local festival? Band of friends of mine playing? Oh, that's awesome. Did they have a nice show, hopefully. And it's late 2 a.m. Man, you still awake, Lord of Heaven? Shout out to you for coming out to the streams. I would imagine you'd be uh, asleep already. Coal thickets. Sorry, we're gonna get some food later. Ore in thickets. Iron forge can't work because it's missing. Okay, we gotta get ore next. So I guess I see what they want to do here. It becomes a thing where. Oh yeah, we're not uh, people here anymore. Sleep is next on the list. Hey, I see you over there. Just like Mamba. So this game is like your birds and you're trying to make a flying kingdom. And later on, we're going to get pirates attacking us. But even though we're birds, we got to use airplanes. Makes a lot of sense. But then, yeah, right now, we're just uh, doing some airborne kingdom. Let's go to the ore. We're going to skip the food. Actually, no, we'll go straight to the food. Alright, do the food and wood right now. And then we'll grab some ore. Ancient ruins. But yeah, right now I could see there's a couple of mechanics. We have an airship. We have to keep it flying, so then there's a weight balance. Uh, there's also an axis, meaning that if you build everything on the left side, it's going to tilt to the left. So there's a weight balance on this as well. 
and it seems like they want you to do resource management because one of the things they brought up was upgrading to max speed is kind of useful because if you travel to the location you want to get to faster you have less of uh, resources burned so i was like okay that makes sense i guess but it's one of those things where it's like okay Ooh, next one go for that one let's go here so i'm kind of curious to see how they're gonna work this out the thing is, is that I'm playing at max speed right now, fast forward speed, and it barely feels like it's at playable speed. Like I'm playing on 3x fastest, and this is still feels like it could be a little bit too slow. Game seems cool. Yeah, colony management. Right now, though, we're not doing a lot because it's the beginning of the game. Oh, we found 199. What? I also would like blogs. I would like to see what just popped up. I just found something and I don't know what it was. Hunt for money at this ruin. Coins are highly valued. Oh, we found monies. Uh, should I go back to the other ancient ruin then? Back there? Because there was one. Oh, did we finish the horse? Yeah, we did. Okay. Let's get some more ores right here then. And then we'll likely have to go to the town anyway, so let's visit. Let's go, let's go. Oh, wow. They even have their uh, name spelled out. Look at how baller these guys are. They have their name right there in the grass. <laughs> hey, guys, we're Haven, though. Wow, that all got mined out immediately. Okay, let's go to Haven Mill. Haven Mill is the largest city in the Erie, outside of the capital, Litalus itself. It's really grown from the small farming village it once was. We should visit Magistrate Agatha. Okay, go to the tower. You guys don't look like pirates. Don't not worry, we are not. Well, that's a relief. I have to admit, it. it's been a long time since I've seen a machine like yours in the Erie that wasn't aiming cannon fire down at us. But I remember the old stories of flying cities, adventurers, adventurers that piloted them from place to place across the world. Now we're in need of help. So you're gonna act the part or am I gonna have to tell Pyle to get out the walls again? He hates it when I do that. It's the merchant Pyle. Every time one of those pirates buzzes by, I can't get back to sleep for hours. They always make such a racket. See? Now listen, if you're really going to fly that thing, you should help us out. The old Airborne Kingdom was a place of learning, construction, and of valiant deeds. You could start by helping us out to rebuild our academy and market. What would you have us do? You can direct building, but we need resources. Traveling by foot isn't safe anymore. Doesn't look like that's a problem for you. Uh, sure. All right, assisting repairs. Let's go to the tavern. Can we get some more help? Ah, all right. Let's get a guy and leave. We got to build another house. All right, we're putting it over here because I want to balance on my ship. Nice. We hold another five people now. Tavern, we're just gonna hire everyone. Now we're at max 20, let's go. All right, so... Repairing. They're doing the thing. Having them repair. Uh, let's go send some uh, wood chuckers. Let's grab some ore as well. 
Oh, I don't have uh, anyone idle. Oh, I don't have any more ships. I think that's what it is. Yep, all right. So they're working. We just have to wait for them. We have to maintain our resources. Food and water to eat. Coal to burn for fuel. Housing is good. No one is sick. We have wood, iron. We are researching. So everything seems okay so far. Looks like we're going to become a flying fortress. At least that's what it seems like. All right. Repaired. So we're good. Uh, let's go through the tower. Would you look at that? You're our savior, kid, with the academy and market back operational. Haven Mill is going to have to, or it's going to live to fight another day. But we couldn't be without a gracious neighbor if we didn't pay you back in kind. So here's this blueprint. Make sure to light your buildings and paths at night. It is dangerous in the dark. You'll need glass to build street lamps, and it's a rare resource. We'll give you enough to get started, but you'll probably want to make your own eventually. Thank you. All right, you're the real deal. All right, looking good. Man, he has a lot to talk about. Give the blueprint to a scholar of your academy. They'll know what to do with it. Now I have one more thing to ask. Uh, help us out. With defense, no offense. So they want a defense tower. Sure. All right. We want to go to the academy. We can't afford any of the blueprints. Feels bad. Let's go to the market. Oh, they have glass here. Oh, I have to buy it. Oh, they're not actually giving it to us. That sucks. Let's just buy the glass. You said it was rare. All right. We're out this. Okay, so I should be able to do ore now. Uh, I'll go back and get some food. That probably doesn't matter. Probably go this way. All right, we're going to cast a Ragna. So, north, and I'm going north. East. Wait, pirates coming? Okay. What does that mean? What does that mean? No one's in the skies. Those are my ships. Is that this guy? Oh, that's a pirate fighter. Wait, 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 wait. How am I supposed to protect myself? Oh. What the heck? Hey, man, what the heck? How am I even supposed to... Do they literally just fly by, shoot you twice, and leave? Because he's gone, dude. And I couldn't do anything about it. Oh, that sucks. That actually sucks. Uh, increase lift provided by home base. Increase propulsion by home base. And then increase morale, increase shelter. All right, we'll just go with that. And that was rude. Okay. 
So we gotta go this way. We could grab wood, I guess. I don't know if I actually need it. I don't know if I need to grab coal. We seem okay. Water seems fine. Oh, we look like we need to go this way. All right, let's send five people here and grab some water. We are a little bit low. We'll go by right now. Cotton, maybe we should grab some cotton. Looks like I am going to need some uh, resource soon. We are heading in the right direction. Alright, let's unassign, reassign. Ooh, the movement's a little bit nice. All right, we'll grab as much as we can, just flying past. Looks like I do want to build a warehouse. Not enough lift to support the way. Oof. So I need the lift first. All right, we're at 72. We're at 64 now. It's not bad. All right. There's some wood here. Let's go for that. We'll continue. Wood, stone for iron, water's fine. Maybe some food. We got to make it towards uh, Cast of Ragna, though. That's on the right. Missing ore. Okay. Y'all got it. Y'all got it. Oh, what's this? Hey, it's another little settlement. Yeah, we're not gonna get those guys yet. We're maxed out anyways. Alright, so we need to go this way. Negative plus. Oh. Alright, that's empty. Let's grab the food. We're going over here, right? See the cast of Ragna. That's the one thing I hate about this. Right click moves your camera and at the same time right click moves your shit. I absolutely hate that. Oh, there it is. Cast a Ragna. Alright. Uh you never have too much wood or ore. Looks like food's fine. All right, let's go through the tower. Ha! Uh, what? Eyes forward, men. Who dares flies above the skies? I told her this would happen. Kept telling her I would exaggerate. Look who's needing combat blueprints now. So we'll take defense tower schematic delivered to Agatha. Okay. Thank you. What's the favor? Tell her I told you so. <laughs> Wait, we gotta go to the tower? Uh, the rangers have not reported. Find the ranger. Make sure she's safe and sound. I will mark location on your map. And I will warn you that the area has been hotbed of pirate activity. Okay. I'm out this. So we're going back. Wait, but what? 
Oh, that's where the ranger is. Okay. So, we need to go backwards, right? So it looks like it's not so much like stockpiling. It's just making sure that you pick up the right resources while you pass by. That's really what it looks like right now. We're going to need water. The only thing I have about this is that this is a really slow paced game. Very, very slow. This is max speed, by the way. Very slow, very chill game. Uh, is there any food? Grab that, I guess. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, yeah, there we go. That's the right direction. Uh, coal would be kind of nice. We're flying that way anyway, so we should be good. storage full doing good looks like I'm a little bit tilted my town center needs to be upgraded though for a little bit more uh, speed what's my cat doing Five workers stopped. Okay, got the research. Propulsion. Yes. That is speed. So we need that. All right. Haven Mill. I guess we could do a little bit of food. Coal. No, we're good on everything right now. Guess we're grabbing wood. Tower. Pirates attack. All right. We have to build a defense tower. All right. Oh, I had the materials. Okay, cool. Uh, I don't need to recruit. I don't have money to buy a blueprint. How come this is not being tracked? Oh, it is. Oh, the progress bar. I see it. Missing ore. Otherwise, we are just chilling. building the towers, and then we're going to go save the ranger. Man, you just move very slow, though. What? There we go. Alright. Get the quests. We save them, boys. All 
Okay, so that's the same spot as the island bandits. Okay. There's a market. I don't know what he just said. So we're leaving. Oh, nice. We just have 500 gold. Nice. Uh, let's go buy a blueprint. Food silo, coal storage, water tower. So this is just extra storage. He just talked about food. Let's go grab that. Okay, so... Oh, I unlocked it. I have to research it still. Okay, that sucks. Okay, I need to go slightly northwest. We need to stop. All right. Uh, we're just researching right now. Can't really do too much. Buildings can't be upgraded, right? At least not yet. So we're just moving around. Yeah, it looks like we're going to do all the ruins. It's going to be free monies. Let's go, let's go. I guess if we find some fish, we could eat that as well. Cold deposit. Oh, no. Yo, man, I'm leaving. Dude, thug life. We're just gonna keep going. Oh. Rude guy. Oh, man. Hit it twice. We got the repairs already, though. Dude, he keeps hitting it. Dude, this guy won't stop, dude. He keeps hitting the same house. Dude, can you stop, man? Can we do something about the pirate? Dude, man, this guy's a menace. Can we just not hit him or anything? Gather resources interacts. So I have no defense mechanisms, huh? Okay, we could do the lift upgrade. Alright, that takes time. Okay, we got the extra lift. Iron mining cab. Oh, wow. Free iron. Oh, and we got this. Dude, why did he hit my, my freaking house like 50 times? I got was extra rude. Okay, we got the monies. Not bad. No food or water. Alright, once we get to the high ground, there it is. We get to the city. 
grab some coal, I guess. Or inspire. We're in, we're in. Alright. Let's go to the tower. We got to the scholar. Hey man, I was told to come here. Alright, we got a weapon. Finally. Sky Dock. Missing. On our way. Alright, tavern quests. Military. Talking about the Empire. Weapons, history, learning. Alright. Uh, we're not going to take anyone. Oh, we lost a guy. How do we lose a guy? All right, so this is going to be story driven. Okay. All right, let's go east. That's this way. Wait, wait, I'm still going to go west. Shh, I'm going wrong way. <laughs> going wrong way, man. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, so food and water, the next things I need to find. That is cotton, coal. Nice. Uh, street lamp for the lights. And food silo. I'm going to go for that. We have an ancient beacon. Wait, do I not do anything with ancient beacons yet? I guess not. Cotton farm, all the cotton meadows. What's this say? Beacon of Alias. Cotton meadow wood. Oh, fish. That's food. Now we just have to find some fresh water. Okay, I see it. We're going over there. So this is a little bit southwest, which is okay. So now we just have to find the, the ranger. Nice. Food silo done. Combat defense tower. Cotton thicket or all right. We need to find the quests. Fish is good. Let's go more that way. I feel like going to the center is probably very smart. Water is going to be fine. Ranger station. Okay. All right, Ranger. Bandit trouble. Alright, beat up the bandits. Okay, island bandits. So they want me to keep going. Okay. So I could already see this is going to be very different from Wandering Village, where you keep walking. This is going to be a story-driven map. I think that was a great decision. 
I think that makes it a little bit more niche in its own little genre. I'm curious to figure out what the numbers are gonna mean. I saw numbers everywhere. It's probably gonna be like plot points, maybe. But for the most part, this seems not bad. Having to get beat up by pirates in the beginning though, it kinda sucks. All right, let's get more airplanes. That's always gonna be nice. Okay, so we have to go there to finish that up. This is, uh... I just feel like this is just too slow of a game. It's one of those things that it's like... I like, I like the concept. It's kind of like Pokemon. When they came out with like X, Y, and Z, no, was X, Y, Z, or was it black and white, or was it pearl, sapphire? They slowed the game down, thinking that the players didn't notice the difference. And then it's the players realized that, and it was like, dude, everyone just stopped playing that version of the game. So it's like, there is such a thing as too slow to chill. I would know that, because I happen to be too slow to chill sometimes. And I feel like this, this game suffers from the same thing. Maybe I'm just too early in the game. It's kind of like when you play uh, MMORPG and you don't have a mount yet. And you're like, dude, you walk slow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that happens sometimes. Maybe we're suffering from the same thing here. It feels slow, but it's not really. We are at 34%. We will get faster later. Oh, combat. Defense tower. I wonder if they're going to make you do layers. Probably not, given how the game looks like. I don't think they're going to make you do like uh, one floor, two floor. I could see them having upgraded housing though and make it a little bit better. I haven't found any outpost either. I haven't been able to do the food for it. We have food. It's not really a big deal either. This is just weird, man. I don't like how this is 3x speed. The game does have good mechanics, though, that I wouldn't mind playing. It does, I feel like it just needs to be faster a little bit. It also might seem like it's coming from, like, I'm always doing the instant gratification. Dude, I just think it's slow. It's not even instant gratification, either. More pirates. Okay. We have two people here. Maybe we shoot them down. All right, got the upgrades. House upgrade for size. Gonna go to Bandit Island. Dude, I got defense towers, man. What you gonna do? Nice. Oh my god. Oh my god. They are hurting my defense tower. Ah, we got them though, boys. They're gonna fall down into the water. Ah, uh, we defeated the bandits. Let's go talk to Ranger Miri. Oh, that was it? Oh, man. <laughs> I wish you could do that. Right click on the dot. 
so that you auto travel back. Oh man. <laughs> Oh my god. Traveling is literally 99%. Literally 99%. Traveling is somehow 99% of everything. Dude, that quest was over in a second. I didn't even reach the islands. I just got close. Oh, now we just gotta fly back, huh? That's, I think, the, the biggest shortcoming with this game. Ah, oh, man. And this is 3x speed. Walking simulation in the air. Yeah. Guys, we're going to wrap up right here. This game has has a lot of good concepts. I know I'm bashing it right now based off just how slow the travel is. That's a small tweak in the grand scheme of things. Looks like they flush it out, has a lot of things to work on. I mean, not work on, like they, that they already have worked on, so it's not bad. This air travel movement, they could easily speed this up. But this seems like a very chill game, right? The problem with it is that it feels like while it's chill, you kind of need to be here the entire time. And I think that's going to be where the pitfall is. Like having a slow game, usually the benefit is you could get up and walk away anytime you need to. And it's still not going to be that bad. I don't think that's going to be the case for this game. Just because you have to manage food and the storage is kind of low. Like you can upgrade, but then that comes at a cost of speed. Right, because then the more buildings you have, the slower you get, the more propulsion you're gonna need, things like that. So I think that's gonna be the thing about that. It's like it's chill, but you have to be here. So it just makes for slow gameplay and that's tough. Yeah, we're not even gonna grab that. So guys, we're gonna stop right here. And we're gonna be wrapping up the Airborne Empire.